Hi guys, it's me, Mikey Boy BJD, or Mikey BJD Boy, uh, with a little bit of a package opening uh, for my Blythe, which I went through another company. This is how it arrived, not even in a box. So I'm hoping for the best, but I'm not sure. Um, I got it off of AliExpress. It should be the broom, the dark-haired one. Um, and they were, when I purchased them, they were $17.33, free shipping. And the shop is Twilight Sparkle Toy Store. Um, their feedback, I don't know if you'll be able to... No, that's not going to... No? Okay. Um, but it's Twilight Sparkle Toy Store, which I've never went through. Um, I've went through a few different places on um, AliExpress for uh, Blythe before, but I've never went through this one. Um, I got this girl off of AliExpress, and I put new eye chips in her. But I don't advise um, <clears throat> doing it while they're in the head. And I did cut her hair down. I had to use clippers. Actual hair clippers to cut her hair. Because scissors, even my sharp hair cutting scissors, were not cutting this hair for some reason. It was ridiculous. So, And I found that I got a much better line with it with um, the clippers on it. Um, these headphones I got, they're my life. And uh, thanks to Trudy Oscillate Wildly's uh, heads up, I was able to see if they had a pair, and uh, they did. So I got them for her. And she's in a full Bratz get-up. Now, she's on the regular um, body. It's not jointed or anything, so it does fit fairly decent. Um, some Barbie clothes will fit them. Um, skipper clothes fit them. Um, so I've kind of played with different things like that. Um, the Shibajuku girl clothes will fit them. Uh, so... But I know the, I don't have one of the jointed bodies, but that was because a lot of people said they weren't very stable or sturdy. So I was like, hmm, okay, so we have bubble wrap, so, okay, so maybe that's good, I, I'm not 100% sure, um, we'll open it up and see together. Um, and so then you two can see what it is. Um, now, they're unavailable uh, from the Starlight as of now. Um, for some reason, after I ordered, then they were sold out. So, we shall see what we shall see. Okay, so bubble wrap, which always comes in handy. Okay, and so, she is more of the Blythe, um, because these others, uh, like my little Ava here, she's a icy dog, um, so she is a little different sculpt. Oh, look, they gave a little, cute little dress, even. That, you know, honestly, that's not horribly bad. Um, yeah, that could work definitely for somebody. Um, maybe even her when it's all said and done. Oh, she even came with clothes and a stand. So, I took a chance, you guys, but not horrible. It came with a 
she came with a clear stand like such which actually these are really sturdy because you put the feet in there and the way the legs go through it really anchors them in there so then you don't have the weeble wobble or them falling over because the head the heads with these whoop, drop the shoes the heads with these are you know they make them a little top heavy so it did come with some gummy kind of little high heel shoes which not a big fan of these kind um, to be quite honest so I prefer them in um, more natural or uh, like B R B J D S, you know, more like real shoes and stuff. And uh, so I'll probably order a pair of shoes on uh, AliExpress as well. They had a couple pairs of ki little kitty cat shoes that were so cute. Um, I want to check something out here. I want to see. Okay, so she's the dark. I'm not even showing her off or even. And actually the hair is pretty good, you guys. So sometimes taking chances does pay off. Um, I was a little scared, but I mean, mm, 17 bucks. Worst case, I'd get, you know, something weird like a dildo or, you know, something like that. Because I heard of that happening. Okay. This doesn't have blight or anything on the back of the head. So. And that's kind of what I was looking at to see whether it was... Blythe, um, no Takara on the back side, so definitely, definitely a fakey. Um, but, um, with this one, see, I'm so used to just having the Icy Dolls, um, I can definitely already see the shape difference. And that was what, a, actually, this dress is really quite pretty. Um, she'll probably stay in this. Because it is, they, whoop, see, top heavy. <laughs> but they sent her in this, well, it's getting washed out, but look. I think it's light from yonder window again. That window sometimes, with the angles. But it's a really pretty lacy dress. Cool. And so, let's see, let's put them together and show them off. Oh yeah, you could tell the difference in the head shape of an Icy Doll here compared to that of a Blythe, or a Blythe, fake Blythe, I should say. So, but I'm going to customize this one too, so... More so than the rest of the gang. The rest of the gang, I only changed out uh, two of their chips so far. So, um, this one I'll probably go ahead and customize the majority of the chips. Um, and put fuller, nicer eyelashes and... I don't know whether I'll go as far as to carve, but we'll see. Um, yeah, that doesn't fit together real great. Oh, it's just not sealed real good. That's okay, because I'm going to customize her anyway. But there she is. And these are picking up as pink or orange on the camera here. But they're kind of a pinky... I don't know, it's just kind of a different tone. Let's see how the, how our uh, action is here. Pretty smooth mechanism, actually. 
There's the blue. Actually, I like those. Those are pretty. Ooh. Those are... Wow, okay. Maybe I'll keep a couple of them. Yeah, those... Those are kind of a golden brown. They're pretty. But maybe we could do something else. I really like how smooth... Now, this one, it seems like the mechanism... The string is much smoother. Like, the transition is much smoother. So it's much more blithe-like. Ooh, I really do like her. Um, it, not gonna lie, it took probably, I ordered her the first week of last month. So it took a hot minute to get here, but she was well worth the wait. Very pretty. Very pretty. So, new edition. Little box opening there. Um, basically, I've just been doing a lot of vinyl repaints here lately, guys. It's crazy. Um, kind of... I don't know, just kind of, I don't have any resin that's come in as of yet, but I will have resin coming in. Um, I was very lucky, fortunate, blessed, humbled uh, to win Shelby's giveaway. Um, watching the video, I was just like, oh my god, and, and of course, she, uh, DM'd me, uh, first thing in the morning, and I'm sitting, I just had woke up, and I'm like, oh, what's the matter, is everything okay, you know, and she's like, go to the channel, check it out, and I was just like, what? What? Really? Because I'm one of those, I don't win anything. And I was just shocked and happy. I mean, brought me instant joy. So, I mean, literally, that was like, wow. So, and then... There's been other things that have come up, and they'll be in future openings, too. Um, wonderful things. Uh, beautiful gifts from people. Uh, so, yeah. There's that. I have some gifts to go out. Um, but otherwise, um, that's about it. I've really, yeah... This is one of my latest I've been working on. He's coming along. I I still have a ways to go with him. I'm still not 100% with him. But this is a man bun can um, head on a articulated um, Ken body. But it was much more in the tan range. So I just went ahead and blushed the head up to match a little bit. And I also matted the hair. The hair was so damn shiny it was unnatural. So now it just kind of has that natural glow to it. You know, so there's that. Um, still working on this lady here. My little... Um, oh yeah, her name isn't going to come to me right now. Raven, Queen, from Ever After High. Um, I did her bodice. I'm adding some details to the bodice and, and whatnot. 
Her face-up turned out pretty decent. I'm pretty happy with that. I really am. So, just figure, figuring, figuring, tongue-tied and twisted. I've worked all day. And huffed hairspray. Um, so, I want her to have some sort of full kind of skirt or something. Maybe even a mini. I don't know. I'll just play with different effects and see what what kind of sets. Um, she does have her original hair up under the under. Uh, see, tongue tied again. Uh, under there, so yeah. There's a lot of people that get tongue tied during their videos. It's okay, isn't it? We just roll with it. You know, it's like one of those. Uh, 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 you know, like one of those catchy things. So okay. I think that is it for as far as what I've been up to. My coffee doll. I love her doll. I just had to throw that in. I just love her. So, and Tiffy, um, very worth the money these girls are. Um, I, you know, just I wanted to try one so bad. Um, it even came with the stand, the stand that it's on, and it's pretty sturdy, pretty nice. But she was my flavy, you know, of all of them. I was like, I liked a lot of them, don't get me wrong, um, still do. But, um, yeah, she was my favorite out of all of those, so, yeah. But anyway, guys, about 1651, that's a pretty good video. Um, I did a tag last night, uh, the Never Have I Ever. Um, I do plan on doing part two and the names tag, too, so you might see me after a while. All right, guys. Talk to you soon. Love you all. Be good to each other. That's for sure. Bye.